For years, ultra-high frame rate video capabilities seemed out of reach for Nikon, as competitors like Sony pushed the boundaries with stacked sensor designs that enabled extreme slow-motion video. However, Nikon is now poised to leapfrog the competition with the announcement of a revolutionary new sensor that can capture 4K footage at an astonishing 1,000 frames per second. So what exactly is this powerful innovation capable of? In a recent briefing with journalists, Nikon unveiled details about this technological marvel, which they claim offers the world's highest levels of sensor performance. The sensor features a 1-inch stacked CMOS design that packs a robust 17.8 megapixel resolution into a compact size. This impressive sensor harnesses cutting-edge, fine-pitch wafer-level wire connection technology to read data off the sensor at unprecedented speeds. A Nikon spokesperson explained that the new stacked CMOS image sensor uses fine-pitch wafer-level wire connection technology, consistent with a 2.7 micrometers pixel size. It boasts a total pixel count of approximately 17.8 megapixels, enabling 4KX4K high-resolution imaging at 1,000 frames per second, with an impressive 110 dB high dynamic range. This is one of the widest dynamic ranges in the industry, making it a significant advancement in sensor technology. While the one-inch sensor size suggests that this component may initially be targeted toward industrial or specialty applications rather than mainstream consumer cameras, the capabilities of this new sensor could hint at exciting developments for Nikon's photography lineup in the future. The key to this sensor's capabilities lies in its stacked design which allows for dramatically faster data readout speeds compared to traditional semiconductor designs. This enables the simultaneous capture of high resolutions and high frame rates, a combination that has previously been challenging to achieve. Sony has already demonstrated the potential of stacked sensors in flagship mirrorless cameras like the Alpha One, which pairs a 50 megapixel sensor with capabilities like 8K 30P video, However, Nikon's new sensor shows just how much untapped potential remains within this architecture. Essentially, super slow motion video capabilities that were once reserved only for specialized high-speed video cameras, now integrated into a single solid-state imaging chip. The potential for videographers is immense. Even footage captured at a slightly reduced 4K resolution of 3840 x 2160 would still be recorded at over 900 frames per second, allowing for the capture of events that are impossible to perceive with the naked eye. And this is before considering the 110 dB dynamic range, which provides an extraordinary level of detail in high contrast scenes. But Nikon didn't stop there. They also revealed that the sensor can be adjusted to capture 4K 60p video with a scarcely believable 134 dB dynamic range. This capability could effectively eliminate the need for multiple cameras in different lighting scenarios, as this single chip may have the flexibility to handle it all with ease. Of course, turning such an advanced imaging solution into a working production camera presents significant challenges. Issues like heat dissipation, managing the overwhelming flow of raw data, and the sheer processing power required are all hurdles that could delay the integration of this technology into consumer devices. However, the potential of this sensor is undeniable. Even if this technology is initially intended for specialized markets, sensors like this one lay out an enticing vision for the future, one where video capabilities currently limited to multi-million dollar broadcast rigs could potentially be democratized and made accessible to both professional and consumer-level handheld devices. It's an incredibly tantalizing prospect that is likely to excite photographers and videographers everywhere, sparking imaginations with the creative possibilities enabled by such a breakthrough. While this level of technology isn't quite ready for mainstream use, Nikon's latest marvel suggests that ultra-high-speed 4K video may soon move from the realm of science fiction to becoming a standard feature in the not-so-distant future. The world of photography is buzzing with rumors about the upcoming Nikon Z9 Mark II. 
a flagship, mirrorless camera that could introduce groundbreaking features, positioning it as a direct competitor to the anticipated Canon R1 and Sony A93. If the rumors hold true, the Nikon Z9 Mark II could be a game-changer for professional photographers, offering high-speed performance and cutting-edge technology. Let's dive into what we know so far and compare it with Sony's A93, which is likely to be its closest rival. The Nikon Z9 Mark II is said to be an enhanced version of the Nikon Z9, a camera already renowned for its performance. However, the Z9 Mark II is rumored to push the boundaries further, boasting a 20.4 megapixel sensor with a lightning-fast readout speed of 0.4 milliseconds. This would be an impressive feat, offering ultra-fast data capture that is crucial for high-speed photography. One of the most anticipated features of the Nikon Z9 Mark II is the possible introduction of a global shutter, a feature that would set it apart from traditional rolling shutters. Rolling shutters tend to create distortion, often referred to as jello effect, when shooting fast-moving subjects. A global shutter, on the other hand, captures the entire image in a single moment, eliminating distortion and making it ideal for sports, wildlife, and action photographers. If Nikon manages to implement this feature, the Z9 II could become a go-to camera for photographers who need to capture high-speed action with absolute precision. In terms of processing, the Nikon Z9 Mark II is expected to feature dual Xpeed 7 processors, which would significantly boost the camera's speed and performance. This setup is likely to enable fast, continuous shooting, smooth 4K video recording, and quick handling of large image files. Even though Nikon is reportedly testing the newer Xpeed 8 processors, the dual Xpeed 7 configuration should still deliver more than enough power for professional needs. The rumored release date for the Nikon Z9 Mark II is either late 2024 or early 2025, so photographers may have to wait a bit longer for official announcements. However, if these specs hold true, the Z9 II could set a new standard for Nikon's flagship mirrorless lineup. A93's most impressive rumored features is its continuous shooting speed of up to 120 frames per second. This would outpace the Nikon Z9 II, which is expected to offer fast burst shooting, but may not reach 120 FPS. If you're a photographer who needs to capture the fastest action, whether in sports or wildlife photography, the A9 III could be the better option in this department. The Nikon Z9 II is expected to feature dual Xpeed 7 processors while the Sony A93 will likely use the Bion ZXR processor, which has already proven itself in Sony's flagship cameras like the Alpha One. Both cameras are expected to offer excellent performance in terms of speed, data handling, and video processing, but it will be interesting to see how they stack up in real-world tests. Which camera is right for you? Ultimately, the choice between the Nikon Z9 Mark II and Sony A93 will come down to your specific needs and preferences. If you're already invested in Nikon's ecosystem, the Z9 II could be the perfect upgrade, offering a balanced combination of speed, performance, and flash capabilities. On the other hand, if you prioritize absolute speed, both in continuous shooting and flash sync, the Sony A93 might be the better option. Both cameras are set to raise the bar for professional mirrorless photography, and whichever one you choose, you're likely to get a top-of-the-line tool for high-speed precision photography. Keep an eye out for official announcements as these models get closer to their release dates, and be prepared for a new era of mirrorless performance.